Hi, I'm good. Good morning and welcome to Fashion Week. So this is where we all get ready um, and it's a really, really nice morning. It's more quiet. We are going to Acris and I'm going to be taking you guys with me. Um, it is a Sunday vibe, but we are going to be shooting a few looks before we go to the show. Yes, this is what I want to do. I mean, I do love fashion and um, it's quite nice also that everybody is also coming in from different countries. Um, and sometimes because it became kind of like your work and it, it, you know, in a sense, you know, with everybody watching, you feel like it's sort of a competition in a sense for them. But for me, I do truly love it. And that's why I'm here because I, I enjoy fashion. I just enjoy seeing the shows, studying the art behind it, meeting the designers, and this is what keeps me going. So I feel like, you know, I'll be here till I'm 50, if you will have me. I truly do love Lou Bouton. Uh, he became a good friend. Um, he's so nice that, you know, he would even cook uh, truffle pasta for us. Like, we have a really, really good relationship. I'm also excited to work with Jean Battista Valley. Um, that's something that I look forward to. Uh, we're creating something together, and hopefully, I, I see him this week. Um, but I do love just attending, you know, all the shows. It's a different field. You feel like, as a person, you have different facets. So each designer, each show you go to, it's a representative of different characters that you hold from within. So. Honestly, it's I love how they do it, especially here in France, that they allow you to just express yourself. And I think this is what's important. You have Dior that they allow you to just, you know, choose whatever you like and, you know, come in as you are. And so I, I do enjoy that. I'm small but terrible. I'm 5'2", and I do love how, you know, Lou Bouton makes you look so beautiful and elegant. And yeah, I guess the pain comes with it, but I don't really feel pain. At some point, you know, you, your pain tolerance kind of <laughs> goes higher, so it becomes normal to you and innate in a sense. is always good. I think Paris is like my alter universe in a sense because here I get to walk. Now the Philippines is a little a little bit more complicated. So here I get to live um, not freely. I love my life in the Philippines, but I, I'm here I'm, I'm just very myself. I love the good and the bad. Let's just say that I have accepted that from Paris and you know I I have a place also here, so I really do truly love it. And I, I said I'll be doing this till I'm 50. So you'll see me also when I'm older walking around buying flowers. Restaurants, I love um, Le Petit Lutetia. Um, I love that. I think that was one of the first restaurants that I um, fell in love with. It's a small restaurant. It's always full for Fashion Week, but um, I do have friends who work there, so they give me a table. And I do have a big team, so I like to take them with me, you know. But I do love that. Um, of course, I'm always a, I'm always a Le Bon Marché. I could also do the um, uh, B, Le BHV here in Murray. I do love that. But you can find me anywhere, you know. I also like this small like teacup store of antique goods. It's called Aubon Marie. So I think it's in uh, somewhere in Saint Germain, if, if I'm not mistaken. There are a lot of finds that I love. Or it's markets. Today is a Sunday, so you'll see markets too. I love that. Life is too short. You just do whatever you want to do, and I do enjoy that. You know, I can go anywhere. You can take me anywhere. It's an adventure. I've never taken the the metro though. Maybe that's a different episode. And I love getting my steps, so that's my exercise. Paris has definitely opened up for everyone. And, um, but at the same time, what I love about Parisians is they, they, don't, they care, but in a sense, they, they just let you be. And I like that. That's why you can just be yourself and do whatever you like, you know? They mind their own business and sometimes that's nice. So we are here. And as you can see, winter is coming. Like yesterday, we uh, met with uh, Mr. Elisa, and uh, 
parents' house? Yes, which is always, you know, mind-boggling for me that, you know, it's just a very nice, intimate relationship with his close clients and friends and some people in the industry. So I, I didn't want to miss that. Although I'm, I miss John Batista's big night. Um, but I do try to skip sometimes because I just like to have my Bon Mamu at home and eat when the fashion week is over. Well, when the day is over. Hi, I'm Pat Domingo. I'm here in Paris. We have a shoot here, a lovely shoot with Hart Evangelista. Uh, we're gonna take you around to Paris, doing some looks, doing some shoots, some iconic spots here, and easy going. You can see how it works during Fashion Week, in between shows and life. Uh, we're gonna shoot several outfits with Hart. Um, for now, it's Louis Vuitton. I treat my clients as my friends. That's what I'm famous for. So I bring the energy from all the way from the beginning to the end. It's not easy to be perfect. You're perfect already, but it's, like, it's, it's to maintain the perfectness. It's actually the first time we worked together. I shot her quite often during street style or other clients of mine. But uh, finally we had the time to manage to work together, like officially. So that's fine, it's, it's a first timer for me too. We're gonna go back to work. It's a lovely dress in this lovely color. So it's our first time to work together. Um, I'm so happy we got to work together, but uh, he, um, he was highly highly suggested by um, my good friend Edward Berthelot, who you also see in Fashion Week. So I'm happy that we were connected and he's also Filipino. And I do love the idea of forever. So hopefully we will all work together forever till we're old and gray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're going over there. Yeah. The Bridge Over Traveled Water by Simon and Garfunkel. We're gonna, we're gonna shoot also against the sun, which is nice. So the next shot, we will do a shortcut. I just put my husband's jacket on. This is actually my gift. It's a YSL jacket. Put some shades and we'll have the cappuccino shot. Exactly, the cappuccino Ooh, shot. Yes. The classic Parisian cappuccino Exactamo. shot. Exactamo. We all need that. This is what you call the real real. Meaning to say, we shoot for the Instagram, but we're just really gonna have the coffee. It's a good break. You have to enjoy while you work.
last look and this was my morning. So tell me again, are we busy today on a Sunday or not? We just finished the shoot, we are back in the hotel and Akris, we are going to be getting ready for that. This is my look. Um, I'm gonna wear this cute skirt. After a really long moment and the show is about to begin, I am so excited for myself and for all of you. So this is the moment where I say enjoy the show. I loved it. I met forever today. I would like to wear those every day of my life. It's the best. Beautiful. Thank you.